Hey folks, good morning. Um, it's Rick. Uh, I wanted to just do this short video, uh, talk about something we got going on uh, at the farm. Um, yeah, we got a gang problem uh, on the farm. Uh, every morning I come out um, and there's, there's a gang that just randomly roams around the farm. Let me show you what I'm talking about. gang is the gang of four. Four fearless Australorms who have chosen to live the foraging, outback, non-shelter lifestyle. have gone back to their Australian roots of self-sufficiency, independence, and fierce protection of those with lesser foraging skills than themselves. So these four Australorps are part of our original flock of birds. So they're about three years old, between three and four years old. And when we built this chicken coop, this is where their original uh, coop was. Well, last year we built our second coop that was attached to the barn. And these four chickens decided they're not moving. If you look back at our one of our previous videos I posted, how do you get the chickens to move? All of the chickens have relocated except for the four Australorps. What's an Australorp? Australorp is an Australian breed of chicken, cross between an Australian bird and an Orpington. Um, they are very hardy birds, very good foraging birds, um, very good egg laying birds. That's what they were really bred for, uh, but. You know, I kind of view them as a dual purpose bird because um, well grown out, they're good size uh, bird that are both good for meat as well as eggs. So on average, they produce about 250 eggs per year. Um, big, large brown eggs. Um, they're just an all around excellent bird. Uh, they're also fiercely, fiercely protective of any birds that may come into their territory. So what's their territory? This is the foraging ground for these Australorps. So any given day I can come out and I'm going to find the gang of four somewhere on the property. They will not go back. I don't feed the birds up here. They will not go back to the barn where there is feed for them to eat. They stay up here in the pasture at the front of the property, foraging from sun up to sundown every day. They don't have a coop. They will either nest in that ditch line right there, that tree line right over there behind the ditch, or under the coop in that little storage area. So that's generally where I'm gonna find them. These Australorps do not go into a coop. Um, they have the opportunity to go to the coop in the back. They just don't. They instead spend all day, every day, foraging up at the front of the property, 
in a pack of four. So this one here is following me around. I've never had hands on these birds. Um, they are fiercely independent, although they're supposed to be um, one of the more docile breeds. I have not found that. They're not at all skittish, um, but they don't like to have hands on either. And these are leaner than some of the other Australorps that we have in the back um, because they literally get no grain. Everything they have is natural foraging that they do all day, every day. So normally when I come out in the morning, they're kind of in their molt season now, so they're losing a lot of their feathers. So every morning when I come out, I'm not sure where I'm going to find the gang of four. Sometimes they're up around where the cars are. Other times they're over on the fence on our side road. Sometimes they're up by the hard road. It's so wherever their whim takes them on any given day at any time of the day.